Alright, hey guys, how you doing? Good morning. Um, got a few things to show you. Got a little box of some stuff. I uh, just wanted to make a quick video on some uh, handhelds, uh, plug and plays, and some of my uh, PC mm. games that I have. Mm. Yeah, yeah. Oh, the gunship. <laughs> All right, so Sunday morning we might go to a thrift store, might not, but let me show you some of my plug and plays. Starting off with some stuff that if you watched my last video, my four month mark video, you would have seen you've probably seen this one, or you've seen this one in my third or fourth video. This is uh, my Miss Pac-Man plug and play. This top part comes out. As you can see. Put it back. Um, haven't played it yet. This price tag still on there. Four bucks. But that's one of the plug and plays I have. Seen this on Metal Jesus Rock's channel. So this is kind of cool. Some more footage of it. Another one you probably saw yesterday if you seen my video. The newest one my wife found uh, found this at a thrift store is a Spider-Man uh, plug and play. No batteries in there. I mean, we still haven't tested this one out yet, but it's cool. I like it. Moving on, I have. this Namco. I like the way it looks. It looks like an old school arcade game. A little joystick right here. And uh, this is another one that I haven't tried out, tested yet. This was, this was actually, with a lot of other stuff I have in the box next to me, um, a few things that was uh, downstairs that I've collected. One of the first few things I collected that I was just sitting downstairs. I believe this was four bucks after a store but um there's the front of it see and I believe it it powers on yeah the batteries are still good in there and so I'm guessing there's Pac-Man games some other cool stuff again I haven't tested this out yet I haven't tested the other two out yet also <coughs> haven't had time yet <coughs> So, another one of my plug and plays, one that I really like, is this um, Scooby Doo Mystery Machine. It looks cool because it's this little Scooby Doo van. This was also reviewed on um, Metal Jesus Rock's channel. I saw this. It's funny because I, I had this one too. And this one also works. I, I, I played this one. It's fun. I like it. I haven't played. There's a couple games on here. I've only played one. But, uh, yeah, you can see the light come on. This actually glows in the dark. So that's my Scooby Doo plug and play. Let's see. This right here I thought was cool just because I'm in the Star Wars. Darth Vader, <coughs> oh, excuse me, Star Wars plug and play. This is something that I also haven't tested out yet. It's been sitting downstairs for a while now on a few um, things that I, one of the first things I collected when I started getting into collecting. Um, I actually have two more of these <laughs> uh, downstairs, but I'm glad to get this. Hopefully, I can. Find some time to test it out. So let's see what else. And then I have this EA Sports. Ah, clean that. EA Sports plugin. Haven't tested this out. Found this at a thrift store. Um, can't remember how much. 
I think it might have been four bucks. I think all my plug and plays were like three to three to four bucks, and they're all found at thrift stores. So that's that. Now this Atari one is kind of cool. An Atari plug and play. In really good condition. Nice and clean. See it works. Again, something that I haven't tested out. <laughs> I believe this is like four bucks. Now some handhelds. Uh, this is something I thought was cool because it just looks like one of those old school, um, well, it just looks like an arcade game, only shrunken down the size. It's a poker game. I'm not really big into uh, gambling, but I like the way this looks and it works. Let me see, turn it on for you guys. Land your bed. <laughs> yep, turn it off. I think this is also four bucks at a thrift store. Let's see. All right, and this is just a handheld. I just I, I showed you already a few of the the well all the plug and plays that I have so far. This is just one of the handhelds I have. This right here is another handheld that I found. Uh, nothing special at a thrift store. I think this is like. 50 cents and it works also it's a uh, ice hockey I just thought it was cool and then these next two items are things I found at thrift store I mean uh, yard sales I'm sorry and Milton Bradley Battleship um, has a date in the back 1995 probably can't see see that oh well but this is a uh, 25 cents at a yard sale a while back cool little handheld uh, good brand Milton Bradley another Milton Bradley game I found at the same yard sale for 25 cents is this hangman so pretty cool again has a yeah, 50 cents here. has a uh, 95, 1995 date on the back. I like Milton Bradley games. They're cool. So that's that one. And this is something that I was really happy to find. I found this at the thrift store. It's nothing special. Wheel of Fortune handheld game. The reason why I really was happy to see this was because my father, when he was alive, he had the exact same one, only a lot bigger. I hear the boys play this, so I'm glad to get this. I uh, need to put new batteries in, uh, get it working again, but forget, I think it's like a buck at the thrift store. Okay, so let's see. That's that for um, my handhelds and. Um, And my uh, plug in place. Let me show you real quick. Some of the stuff. Okay. But that's that. It's a quick video. I'll probably have to uh, make another video real quick of um, my PC games. a little view of the uh, handhelds and um, plug and plays but as always stay tuned hope you guys liked it I have another one up shortly I just don't like making videos super long well they're not really long just YouTube just I don't understand YouTube <laughs> my videos are always too long 11 minutes is too long according to YouTube but hope you guys liked it um, like, comment, subscribe, and I will make another video shortly. Alright, thanks guys.